Hi everybody, this is Carl Brooks from TechLoyal.com and today I'm sharing with you the Sprint MiFi device. It's a neat wireless modem that allows you to surf the web up to five devices, uh, $60 a month for a five gig cap. Uh, unfortunately, I grandfathered into the, the unlimited plan. Uh, so I just upgraded my USB device and replaced that out. The US device, the USB device, used to can just connect to one uh, um, laptop via the USB port, and now for that same monthly fee, I'm able to connect up to five devices. So let's let's put this thing to work. Uh, it has a neat little uh, web interface that you can go to and monitor. Currently, it shows that there are two two devices connect. Two out of five devices are connected. I'm not sure if you can see that very well with this flip middle non-HD device. But let's let's uh, pull up some information on here. I was on I was on uh, YouTube. We'll just pull up any any video. Let that run for a minute. Okay, so I'll mute that, and we'll just keep an eye on that in the background, see if it buffers or, you know, doing anything like that. I also have my Palm Pre here, and it's connected, and I can just simply go to the drop-down area here at the top. Battery's starting to get low here, but you see, connected to the Sprint MiFi 2200, um, and we're there, and so we'll go to bring up a new video here here's a MiFi demonstration so we'll just run that and you see that that's going to buffer for a second but that's using the same internet connection so we have two devices there running we'll see if the one on the top starts to buffer so that's starting to play got the volume turned down let's talk about the MiFi as well and so here we have our third device which is a iPod touch and we'll just go over to settings and take a look at the Wi-Fi connection shows me that the Wi-Fi is connected to the Sprint MiFi 2200 as well and we've got our little icon up there by the iPod word so we'll go on to let's just go to Safari real quick bring up a new web page let's say who always gets the New York Times always gets the demo so we'll just pull that up so you see the video down there playing on YouTube on the Palm Pre the video up in the top turn the volume on for a second that's still running and I think I might have hit the wrong button on this iPod Touch. Somehow I hit the back button, so let's go back forward. And let that Detroit Times, oh, I'm sorry, New York Times load up there. So we'll just sit that over there, let that load. And that should, there it is, just popped up. Okay. New York Times not sure what that picture is there but we'll let that finish doing what is business and let them sit there so that's four de that's three devices if we go back over here you see there's now three devices running and I have a fourth device here which is a Ubuntu Linux PC put together a couple weeks ago first time playing with this in the long t uh, in with Linux in a while and I'm a refresh so that's gonna wake up so that refreshes Google. Let's just go to, um, let's type in Pandora. And while that's waiting, you'll see over here, oh, it said, it said four devices a minute ago. I'm not sure which device is considered no longer there. Because obviously the Palm Pre is still connected and running. The 
uh, New York Times. Let's click on whatever this picture is there. That's still running. And this fourth guy is running over here. So I'm not sure what. Maybe the Palm Pre, because he got completely downloaded, this video is no longer being considered one of the four. So we'll pick Gary the Gadget Guy here. Let that buffer. See if we get still still only showing three devices of five. Um, but we obviously have four devices running here. Go back to YouTube over here. He's still running. Still hadn't buffered once. Uh, which is better than it did the earlier. Pandora starting to low here. And we'll pull up, instead of the New York Times here, we'll pull up the YouTube video as well. And over here, Pandora's up. We'll put in a song artist. I don't know who we want to listen to, but we'll just put in uh, what it looks like he's already playing somebody. Look like a Michael Jackson. So we'll let Michael Jackson play in the background. So Michael Jackson's playing on Pandora.com. The uh, iPod Touches will load up a video we haven't looked at. iPad G3, just as hackable as the Wi Fi version. We'll let that load. It's loading. The play button is available. We'll just look for a couple of these to bar to grow a little bit before we click on it. Still only showing three devices up there, which is weird. We're going to hit play. So that's starting to play. So it looks like that iPod Touch is fighting for don't have anything to play because it hadn't downloaded enough. So that one's getting a little jerky. The PC still running fluid. Pandora running good. Palm Pre running. So four. There's the Palm Pre buffering. Pandora's obviously taking over. Okay. So there you guys go. Four devices running on this one one device. The Sprint. My Fi. Okay, up to five devices. I'll see you guys later. This is Carl Brooks with TechLaw.com, and I'll see you on the web.